Local players have had mixed results on the second day of the Australian Open at Melbourne Park. Leighton Hewitt is currently two sets all against Italian Andreas Seppi. Earlier, Nick Kyrgios run through while James Duckworth and Marinko Matosevic bowed out. Olivia Rogowska progressed while Storm Sanders lost in three sets. Dan Conifer reports. In 18 Australian Open tournaments, Leighton Hewitt has played nearly every match on Rod Laver Arena, but his opponent, Andreas Seppi, soon made himself at home, claiming the first set in a tie-break. You feel like it's a body blow. Seppi broke Hewitt early in the second. Oh, boy, is that good. And claimed the set. That left the crowd hoping for a trademark Hewitt comeback. They weren't disappointed. Their man claiming the third. Got it. And then the fourth, putting the veteran into another deciding set at Melbourne Park. Canberra's Nick Kyrgios looks comfortable at his first Australian Open. He sent more than 30 aces past German Benjamin Becker to move into the second round. The, I think it was mostly the crowd, you know, they got me up, they got me over the line. So. Australian Marinko Matasevic seemed outclassed by Kei Nishikori, but managed to claw his way back. The riddle that is Marinko Matosevic is somehow one set all. Pushed to five sets, Nishikori lost his racket, but not the match, leaving the Australian winless after a dozen Grand Slam appearances. Roger Federer started a record 57th straight major, with young Australian James Duckworth standing in his way briefly. Ah, uh, just too good. Before Federer claimed his first win under new coach, former champion Stefan Edberg. Clearly, in a way, a dream come true for me. I used to watch his matches and get inspired to play, pick up this great game. With the temperature passing 40 degrees, one ball boy needed attention. But so far, the heat's had minimal impact, but there's plenty more to come. Dan Conifer, ABC News, Melbourne.